guys. This is the coolest thing I think I've ever seen. Just watching the school of cobia surface fall each other up when you hook one up. So awesome. And there's so many big ones. Look, look at this. Look, look, look. Too. Look at these. Look at these right here. Look at these by the boat, Jimmy. Let's beat them. Let's beat them. Beat them. Look at this. In this episode of Bean Sport Fishing TV, we're going to Everglades City, also known as Old Florida, for some world class fishing. We'll be going out with our good friend, Captain Jimmy Wheeler, the owner of Everglades Fishing Company, and we'll be going offshore to target some cobia. We're just here having fun, right? We're just gonna have a great day. We're just gonna have fun. Drop some baits down low. And see what happens. See what bites them. Hopefully some cobia. And we got the uh, new append authority here with a new bean pole. Check that out. So we're gonna put this thing to the test today. We're way out in the Gulf of Mexico, and the first bite definitely took us by surprise. Dude, that's, that's on your line. That's on your line. <laughs> <laughs> dude, what is he doing here? He's still on. No, dude. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What are they doing yeah, here? It's cold. There, that's where they go when it gets cold, huh? So Astrid was seeing the fish for the last hour. On a Colin side scan. Fish, and uh, then we just jump a tarpon. I guess that's, uh, this is where they go when it's cold, way out in the Gulf. So a little bit about Cobia. They have a few nicknames, Ling, Lemonfish. They're pretty much part of the Remora family. They often like to follow things such as sharks, rays, and they like to school up with each other. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's him for sure. What is this? This is the uh, Pen Authority 6500 for the Carnage 3 rod. Oh, man. He's coming up, coming up, coming up. Hey, so if this is a big fish, I'm sticking him. Okay. He's coming up, scoping up. There he is. Nice cobia. Oh, Look at that. Pretty. I like that. He's like, no, no, Jimmy. Uh -uh. Not today. <laughs> He's like, no, Jimmy. Jimmy. Woo! Look at that. Holy good mackerel. Fish. That's a good one. That's a good fish, dude. That's a good one. Good stuff. Zero. That's zero. He's shy. Yeah, yeah, that's what I say. Jimmy never disappoints, ever. We just like to have fun. We just like to have fun. We're having fun today. We're already having fun. We jumped off a tar pin. We got Kobe. I've been here for like five minutes, and uh, we're gonna let this bad boy. Let this bad boy. Oh, come on. There he goes. Go and get. He's like, I don't know where to go. He's like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I gotta say, Kobe are tremendously strong for their size. And you can tell when you fillet one, their fillets are so dense. They're such a dense, muscular fish. They're also notorious for being a real handful once you land them in the boat. So I just got the new third edition bean poles in, and what a great fish to put them to the test like a big Kobia. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's him. <laughs> Ice fishing, baby. Dude, that's a hammer. That's a good one? What's that? I appreciate that, brother. That's what I came here for. That's what I came here for, right here, baby. That's a good fish. Got the Pen Authority 4500 on the brand new bean pole. Oh my gosh. You want to get one of these bad boys? 
These are pure carbon fiber blanks. Go to beansportfishing.com. There he is. Uh, followers, 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 followers. Yeah. Try to keep his head up. He's like, yeah, right. Oh. <laughs> My wrist is burning. <laughs> there he is. There he is. Yeah! Yeah, boy! On the bean pole, on the Thorte. Alright. Look at that. Release there he is on the bean pole. We want to release this one. I almost released Jimmy in the water right there. He's ready to roll. Jimmy never disappoints. Kobe at number three so far for the morning. We got a long way to go. Look at that. Look at that fish. Oh. You ready, buddy? There you go. Ta ta for now. So I had to get in on the action, and when I sightcasted at a group of them, I guess I scared them away, but it was still a cool sight. Dude, mine's peeling off of that thing. No? Oh my god. <laughs> He's still green, dude. So this is what happened. I had something on the bottom that felt like a blind grouper. I guess he spit it. I was reeling it in. Then all of a sudden, this Kobe came out, came up and just smoked this. How cool is that? Oh my God. They're Wait. so strong, guys. So I finally got one. This is my personal best cobia so far, guys. Captain Jimmy Wheeler, Everglades City. Super cool. We safely released it and we're going to keep it going. Another cobia. Another cobia. Yeah. Number six. Oh yeah. Anything with him? We're just having fun with the fish at this point. It's nice not to worry about sharks. We kept them in the water, see if uh, followers will come up, and we even tried flipping some of them. Oh, followers! Big followers, followers, followers. Big followers, big followers. Jimmy? Throw some freebies in. On the authority. <laughs> Yep. Yeah. She's good. <laughs> followers. <laughs> yes, I just fallen down by, under the boat. I knew this was a big one. And you gotta watch not only how strong they are, but how fast they can be. Oh, dude, that's a big one. Big follower right behind him. Big follower right behind him. Oh, dude, he smoked it. He smoked it. Oh, my God, he smoked it. Oh, my God, he was hungry. Oh! There he 
There he is. Good hey, one, Kobe. boy. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Hey Astrid, hey Astrid, good luck. Grab this back rod. We got another one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> First keeper Cobia being with the gas shot. So epic. Guys, this is the coolest thing I think I've ever seen. Just watching a school of Cobia surface follow each other up when you hook one up. So awesome. And there's so many big ones. Look at this. Look, look, look. Look at these. Look at these right here. Look at these by the bow, Jimmy. In this moment, we wish we had more hands on deck. Chaos was about to let loose. Hi on the mini, Jimmy. Jimmy mini. Astros! What do we do? What do we do? Kobe of madness! We need another hand. The real. Uh, yeah, this is what tests you right here, Jimmy. Yeah, what? Well, I got this a rod to get below you. the boat. This is what tests you, Jimmy. Jimmy. Oh, dude, he's way up. We have to follow him up. Yeah. Oh, my bad. Dude. There you go. Still recording here. Okay. Anchor mode. We're back. We're back, folks. It's like watching your, your pet. Yeah, it's a big pet. Big pet. <laughs> Why'd I pick up this thing? <laughs> My wrist is smoked. Yeah. Hey, fish, fun fishing right here. Mine's fishing. Like Jimmy, Jimmy over here is horsing them on the beam pole. What do you think, man? I'm they, trying this thing out. It's working. It's got some backbone. I don't know how many Kobe we caught today. We lost count. More hands or not, our crew prevailed and we got the double header on the sight cast. What's so amazing is that with the clarity of the water, there are so many subsurface fish you couldn't see in the camera, but they were there and you can see them in person. It's just wild. There you go. Oh, one fish. Oh, no fish. How about over the bail for you too? Getting going right now. Oh, don't wrap. Don't wrap. Oh no. Oh. Three way high five. <laughs> Look at that. Damn. Damn, son. I sent him back. Oh, there he goes. He's he good, he's good. So this year, FWC put a new regulation on Cobia. They used to be 33 inches to the fork. They're now 36 inches to the fork and max two per vessel. We're eating some Kobe tonight. Oh yeah. What's your favorite part? The of the throat. The collar. They're about the same, dude. Yeah. Win. Win it. Win it for the win. So back to the dock we go to flay the cobia and get them cooked up.
It's very simple to make cobia. Cobia is a very white, flaky fish. We like to butterfly it open so it cooks evenly. We're adding the new Anything Rub by Traeger. You want to make sure the fish is dry and lightly coat the fish with the spice and rub it all in. We're going to set the Traeger to 325 degrees and cook each side for about 10 minutes. You can stick a fork in the middle to see if it's cooked and it's okay if your fresh cobia is a little translucent in the middle. That's the way it should be. So Jimmy just completely revamped the EFC shop after Hurricane Ian destroyed it. It's got a brand new lounge area, new merchandise, all the tackle that you would ever need and a brand new seating area for Nelly's Cafe, the best cafe in the area. All right, folks, as you saw, epic bite with Jimmy today. Always a great time when we come to Everglades City. You have to come down here if you haven't yet. The store's amazing, the fishing out here is outrageous. Jimmy, never disappoint, man. Always a good time. Appreciate you every time. Thank you, brother. And Jimmy's getting new shoes. Look at toes. Stay tuned. It's I'm gonna, the good one or those. I'm gonna need to get me a pair of those right there. Digi camo. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, no. Do it, Jimmy. Oh. Blue lights on, too. Go, baby. I will get your other hand on that side. Uh, so you can hold them right. All right. Let me, let me. Go ahead and situate them. Oh, it's a hell of a blue runner. Oh. Watch out for that blue. I'm a. Oh, it is. Look at that. Fish fishing. Damn. At least they're pretty big. Big stompies. Are you the big stompers? Oh, yeah. Uh, I cover a lot of surface area with this boot, too. One of them flavors. He's so cute. <laughs> nice snook. Yes. Oh, oh, no. No. <laughs> I almost J hooked him, but he wasn't really there. Almost there. He was almost there, so I. Wow. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> no! He's dying. Good thing you take people out to fish. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and now I can just yell at them when it. Uh, Snook. Is it? Snook. Is it? Yeah. That's a good one. Nice. Oh. Show me a little bit. Oh, I got it. Are you sure? Oh. Jimmy, you want to lift it? Oh. Baby, oh. get somebody, get help. I ain't touching. I ain't touching. Baby, no. Oh, don't lose oh, them. God. Don't you lose that fish. <laughs> I ain't touching it. Here, here, I can, I can lift him. I mean, I remember my first oh, time when I landed a snook. Baby! What are you doing? <laughs> are you, oh, we got blue for two. Look at that. Look at that, Jimmy Wheeler, one of the best captains around, puts you on the fish. Look at that snook, huh? Mwah. Go on, get now. My, my beer going. You got you got a pilchard scale right there in that Perfect. beer. Perfect. 